Hello everyone, I am Torior and welcome back to Let's Play House of Iron 4 as Albania. We're currently advancing into the Soviet Union, slowly, but I'm, I'm starting to reconsider. Maybe it would be better if we just try to finish off the axis. Wouldn't it? Going to Romania would be difficult. Helping attack Germany? Maybe. So I think I'm going to cancel the orders once those guys are done. I'm also going to deploy my new tanks um, in a little while. Let's let them train up a little bit more. I'll wait until this province here is taken and then I'll move down. Come on, come on. Although, hmm, I'm not sure what I should do with Bucharest. Probably stop the attack. This one we want. Is that Constanta? Also, hopefully if the attack is made from our territory, we will end up... Oh, you know what? Maybe it's actually better to stay here, because if we take a huge amount of land, and then any further attacks happen from our land, we will end up controlling Soviet Union. That's something to think about. How are you guys doing down south? Oh, you have done your job. Perfect. Istanbul is easily defendable. Alright, let's get those tanks in the field. Assign them to the unit. Select everyone. Division assignment mode. Everyone goes here. Do your job. Yeah, that'll cost us all of our manpower, and much more. Is that expeditionary force from Belgium? Yes! And from Poland. I will accept gladly. So where are those forces? Let's assign you to this army. Now where are you? You're up north. All of you. Mm, right. I'm assuming they will get here at some point. I'm going to assign all of them to this front line and just hope that they get here. They should be able to. It'll take them forever, but I don't want to split my attention. And their help is very much appreciated. Also... We're advancing here quite successfully. Tanks, don't overextend yourself. You have nothing. Almost. Okay, we don't we have too few tanks. Oh, damn it. Can I produce them faster? Need oil. Actually I'm going to buy some oil at this point. Um, buy oil. Netherlands. Sell me the oil I need. That's better. The tanks are a priority. Make sure you produce them. The rest is less important. Oh, am I not forgetting as a priority? No, we actually have air superiority almost everywhere, thanks to the US carriers, probably. So we don't have to worry about that. Oh, you guys seem to be in a dangerous situation. You should take a port. So hopefully we can produce the tanks fast enough to reinforce the divisions. And if not, well, oh well. Current fighting strength 10%. Yeah, I should probably just disband one of them. It's a pity, but I have to. Now we will have enough tanks to supply this one. Did the modern tanks go back to the reserves? 
I'm not sure. I think they did. Right, but we're actually uh, we're actually advancing. So no need to worry. I think. Yeah, the fight over here will be extremely problematic. How's my construction going? Okay, we actually have regained lots of uh, civilian factories in our own territory. I don't want to repair naval dockyards. I don't give a crap about them. Hmm. Yeah, I would, I would like to just build civilian factories here. But we can do it after we get our first reactor and our nuclear bombs. Yeah, seems like the tanks are actually receiving supplies. Although, they went down a level. Which is unfortunate. Where are my expeditionary forces? Ooh, that's a big offensive. Everyone's attacking everywhere. That is a good sign. Seems they were finally ready. Huh. United Kingdom, are you willing to give me this region, maybe? Or this one? This way, maybe the territory taken from there will be mine. Maybe not. I should have asked for something better. This is going to be retaken, possibly. You want to give me more Spain? Just... oh. No, they won't. Actually, I'm going to give you... back what I just took, I think. Or should I? Maybe not. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to give this back to you. And now I'm going to ask for something better in instead. Something more developed. Mostly with more manpower. Oh, we're pushing through. Great. We're pushing through everywhere. This is looking up. Right, so we can just focus on the Soviet Union, I guess. Should I paint new... new salt orders? No, I guess this is fine. Okay, just cut through here, that would be amazing. Um, you know what, let's do that. Let's try and paint such an order. It's going to be almost impossible. If we can pull this off. We just win the war. Yeah, let's see. Not very likely, though they will stop us at some point, but if we could cut them off from supplies, all of these troops would be defeated so easily. Alright, so there's not much mm, more to do, rather than wait, and sometimes maybe occasionally do some manual orders. What's that? Non-aggression pact from China. I'm afraid I'm not uh, too keen on that, at least right now. Hmm. Although I'd gladly attack Saudi Arabia and Iraq if I could. Well, that, that could also be impossible. Mm. Still, just to make our borders look nice, which province in Spain should we take? Or maybe something in Germany? Oh, this has two million people. How about Germany? Three million. Six million. I know what I want. Give me Saxony. Thank you. Yeah, Republic of Albania. So big. So, my contribution is now 21%. Oh, it, it went down. 
Well, I guess the others have occupied a lot of territory, but I think it's more than fair. The United States have 21% war contributions. That is exactly the same as I. Right. Try to cut them off. The Soviet supply chain is not as efficient as one might think. It will be difficult and it will take a lot of time. Oh, this is so beautiful! Wait a minute. When did you let them get here? I'm going to hope that this is not a disaster and that they will retake that territory soon. Otherwise I would need to abandon all my plans and send my troops up there. Or maybe they never controlled this territory. No, 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 no. You need to cancel all your orders. Forget what you were doing. And get here quickly. Super quickly. Probably won't manage, but because it's on the other side of the world. But this can be a disaster, so please help. Okay, we have researched recon company. We also have logistic companies. Logistics companies. Let's get one upgraded. Right, please be fast. Especially the tanks. As if they cut us off, this will be disastrous. I mean, we are quite powerful and we have lots of ports, but we've seen what happened in Italy, and I had, I had to work quite a lot to reverse that problem. So make sure that you guys actually get to the front lines and do it fast. Okay, the United Kingdom announces Balkan Diplomatic uh, Initiative. They're preparing their strategy. Yes, does it matter to us? I'm not sure what that focus does. If I knew, it might matter. Seven divisions. Why just seven divisions? I want everyone on that. Everyone get there. This is important. Also, there's a Soviet outpost here. You guys need to be fast or we will all we will all be in trouble. At least Germany is very, very small now. Very small. Okay, there's actually someone taking care of that. Um, Sweden is defending and it has been defending for years, that's good. And the US is retaking our territory in what used to be Turkey. Yes, I love how they're all spreading my territory. It has its advantages being on the border of the Soviet Union. Not many, though. Very few advantages. UK, you want to give me land? This is 2 million, 3.5. Yeah, this is the best. Give me Thuringia. You will not give me Thuringia. Centralized fire control. All right, that's the doctrine here. Sure, recon company reconnaissance can work. Uh, I think I have chosen the wrong doctrine for this. Still, the doctrine is a doctrine. It can be helpful. Actually, before you move to the front lines, you should take care of these guys here. Our Iranian communist authority has capitulated. So Iran is now controlled by the United Kingdom. Eh, that's fine. And there's a remainder of Vichy France here. Military factory sabotage, because of course it was. What's my... Okay, we have capped on political power. I have not used it for anything. What do we have? Prince of Terror and popular figurehead. I don't have a ship designer. Sure, let's get a ship designer. Military high command. Expert in artillery, because we might have some. Naval aviation combat 
commerce raiding or naval maneuver. Do naval maneuver. I could keep changing the scraping the barrel law back and forth. Oh, I could change my resources. Do I want to change my resources? Produced three. We have surplus in most of them. No, it's it's equal. Well, let's leave the economy alone. It's fine. Yeah, you guys make sure that the Soviets don't get a permanent foothold. Coup d'etat in Yugoslavia. Um, but Yugoslavia doesn't exist anymore. What was that about? Oh, right, this radical Yugoslavia that was supposed to be my territory. They joined the Axis. Weren't they a puppet of Germany? Doesn't make much sense to me. I guess it doesn't really matter. Let's make sure we can take care of the Soviets. Excavation, more resources. Let's do more of that. Right. Oh, who's fighting here? The answer is everyone. Yeah, Germany is now very small. If I pushed here, I could get control of Romania and Hungary. But we need to clean up the Soviet bit. Hopefully by attacking. With everything. And doing it quickly. It will go to Poland. You're welcome. You. There. I did use all my forces for this because I didn't know how strong the Soviet pre presence was. It could have been a problem. It turned out not to be. Actually, as I'm already here, I might want to have a look at the Baltic area and clean this up. Although it is not crucial right now. But it could become a problem later, so I probably should look at that. Right, are there any enemies here? No. Not right now. Okay, so, let's make a new front line, and a new order. We're helping. We're useful. Yeah, the, the AI can do some amazing things, but it needs someone sane. A person who will actually recognize such threats. Like a bit of enemy territory behind your lines, with no troops controlling it. Okay, who's that? Expeditionary force from Switzerland. Three divisions, that is huge. Yes, I accept. Um, and a tank. Let's make sure to assign them all to the main army. Light tanks, my favorite. Light, well, apart from, you know, the modern one. I really liked, uh, like light tanks because they're super fast. Can you guys start moving in? I'm sure they can defend themselves. There, you there, you there. Yeah, the manual attack will be much more efficient. Uh, right. And the expeditionary forces are a bit far away. We've overrun the enemy armies. Great, so now let's try to take Riga and connect the territories and then mop up this area. And then we can return to taking land from our own border. 
I might want to leave a small force in here just to make sure that this doesn't happen again. Although, maybe if it happens again, I'll just send a smaller force. You need to move south first. Actually, we could use a port. Just don't go through enemy territory, please. And just transport you over here. Same with you. That will be faster. And you just go and attack. Take Riga. It'll be over a river, but it shouldn't matter too much. Also, you attack from here. So it's from two sides at least. Okay, it's looking good. Poland. Big and beautiful. So after this operation, I think I can return down south. I'll have to do it through frontline assignment and then not just the move order, because if I do a move order, they'll just move bam, like this. Which would have its advantages. It would not benefit us too much in the long run. Uh, how's our contribution? Can I sort by contribution? You can't sort. 20%. It has gone down because the Allies have taken a lot of territory, but it's still very high. Still trying to break through to Riga. That is alright. Those tanks were supposed to be very fast. Is that because it's mountains? Probably. Oh, what's this? I didn't notice you joined the Allies. Cool. Come on, come on. 90, almost. And this is a difficult attack. Now, Germany, are you, are you surrendering yet? They control 11, they need 10 or less, so basically a few provinces, not even a good province like Vienna, and they will give up. Which is great. Great, great, great. What's that? Soviet outpost? Not for long. Oh, three factories. How many factories did I take? Um, let's make more modern tanks, Mark II. Right, so, what are we constructing? I have finally built the nuclear reactor. The, the bomb will be done in a year. Should I bother with repairing civilian factories? Well, they are repaired quickly and they will help me do other things, but... Hmm. Emilia Romana, Rhineland... Just ignore everything else. Just do civilian factories all the time. Actually, I might just want to build some civilian factories in my own territory first. Sardinia, Latin, Brandenburg, Abruzzo, Calabria. This is proper Albania. Let's just build some nu not nuclear, some you know civilian factories here, and also some nuclear reactors. Wait a minute, did the nuclear reactors here finish? Maybe not. Huh. Okay. That's one in Sicily. I ordered their construction, but they were possibly never finished. They should probably be behind the, you know, 
repair factories order. Although does it really matter? Let's just leave it as is. So how's that breakthrough? You did it. Perfect. Wonderful. So now it's time to move over here. And then we can return home. Hopefully Germany will have given up by then. Why do I want to return home? Well, so that we can attack from the south and thus give me all the territory mm, currently belonging to the Soviet Union. And I'm trying to deal with these guys here so that they don't attack us from behind. That's basically it. If we attack from here, Poland will get most of, of the land. Okay, you guys are going quite fast, but this is well defended, more or less. Um, seems like there's nobody home. Hmm. I could use naval transport to get there faster. Will it really be faster, though? Yes, I think so, because we're going quite far. Quite far indeed. Okay, okay, be faster. Just this one more thing, and actually we will be ending the episode now. Um, it's going very well, <laughs> compared to what it was before. Uh, thank you very much for watching, I hope you did enjoy the video, and I'm going to end it now. As soon as I accept... Okay, Netherlands wants to send us 15 divisions of expeditionary forces. That's beautiful. Thank you, Netherlands. I will accept. And then I'll end the episode. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you soon. Goodbye.